Welcome back folks to another draft episode. We're going to continue with the uh, single player online drafts. As, um, as you saw last week, the online draft I didn't do particularly well. And it was a, well, it's a very sad state of affairs. So in order to not let that happen again, we're going to go back to the single player draft. We're going to see what cards we can get and see if we can improve on this um, team at the moment. So we did go into the market. We did buy a couple of players as well. Uh, Yamalenko from West Ham, I believe. He's already scored a couple of goals for us already. 33,000 coins we paid for him. I thought he was quite uh, decent. Um, I'm not sure if he's an improvement on Werner. He hasn't seemed so just yet, but to be perfectly honest, he's increased our uh, rating up a little bit as well. And uh, we also got Bergwin as well on the left-hand side ahead of Rashford, with whom we have now put on the transfer market. So with them, the only two additional players that we have brought in. It has put our rating up to 188. So really, we want to try and get some more decent players in these particular positions here. It's right back as well. Centre mids, Cam, a centre back and a goalkeeper as well. But uh, we're keeping our eyes peeled. But hopefully some of these packs that hopefully we'll win in today's draft will give us some, uh, some new players. So without any further ado, we'll... Do the usual setup, we'll go straight in, you'll see some footage, and then we'll get to the rewards right at the end. So first of all, we've got to pick a uh, formation. Uh, this is normally the formation we tend to use. We haven't got two up front though, 4-4-2 flat, uh, this is okay. That formation we tend to use, but not a centre forward normally carrying that position. I'm not sure which way to go. Three cams, probably not. 4-4-1-1, I think we can go with that. We'll go with that. 4-4-1-1. We've got to pick a captain. Hazard, uh, again, looks like La Liga is going to be the way to go. Lucas Moray, that's not a bad shout either. He's pretty quick. In fact, both of these are quick. Uh, quick. Anarchy Williams, uh, we'll go with that. Looks like it could be the way that we are going to go. Centre forward. Wow, some uh, great players there. Uh, Mkhitaryan, wow, maybe. Gomez. Uh, we've got uh, Wilson Stryker as well. Obama Yang. Uh, the very La Liga one here is Gerard Marino, so we'll uh, use him instead. If we stick to Paul Bogba, wow. Um, okay, uh, De Bruyne, Man City. How can you not have De Bruyne? Don't know what sort of setup we're going to get just yet, so uh, let's have another look. Uh, 90 again, Le uh, is that Leon? I think it is. One La Liga, Pjanic. Uh, we'll take him then. Let's go on the left-hand side, left midfield. What do we... Oh, Bamba. Nice. Rashford. That's a pretty decent card. Not the card that I had in my team, mine, but uh, that's a pretty decent card as well. Could play alongside um, De Bruyne in the Premier League. Again, La Liga. We've got to stick with La Liga, haven't, haven't we not? Uh, we're going Rashford. <laughs> let's let's stick with Rashford then. Uh, left back. Let's find out what we get here. Jordi Alba will be my top pick there already. So uh, we could pick him and uh, Pace. Mendy's got the better pace. I think we'll go over Albert. I think there that'll do. Going across the line. Very nice indeed. But again, we are struggling for some sort of team here though. But I think we're going to just get nothing with Van Dijk, I guess. 90. It's empty pace. Or Klosterman. Um, we'll go with Klosterman. I've got no idea what sort of team we're picking here. We are uh, against Testegen. I think uh, the top picks there without a shadow of a doubt. Uh, Sergio Ramos, I think quite easily he would fit the build superb. And there, uh, that's not too bad. I don't know where these fit in here. I haven't got a clue. So let's have another look, see what we can get on the right back then. Uh, anybody available? Oh, lovely hair, I like that. Um, absolute rubbish, aren't they? That's, uh, that's terrible, I'm not worth sure. We'll go with that one, don't know why. Um, let's have another right goalkeeper first off then on the on the subs bench. God almighty, these are terrible, really. Uh, nobody really to look at there, is there? So, um, wow, where do we go? Best player, Gomez. Let's go go with him. Hopefully, they're going to be a little bit better as we go along. Left back Davis, Delit, Italy, uh, Navas, left back. Haven't we not already got a uh, left back? Uh, they're all left, but Navas I probably would go with, and uh, Navas can fit straight in, actually. Stick him in there for the time being. Left back, left back, centre back, Fabinho. Um, not sure if I want to, but Gaia. 
if we're sticking with La Liga, Gaia seems to be the, the better choice there. And I think Gaia can cut a slot straight in there. I'd hate to do it, but it does seem does make a little bit more sense. We'll change him as and when we go in. Again, Italy. Uh, no, there's nothing there at all. This is a this is terrible pack. This is a terrible draft already. My word, what's happening? Right, uh, I can see Spanish. I can see La Liga. Who do we pick? Morales, um, left wing. I could go with that, I think. Saul, pace. It has to be Morales on the left-hand side. Take out Rashford. I do have to say sorry. Sorry, Rashford. Unless it does bring the team cohesion up a little bit more better than that. There's chemistry. Left wing again. Yeah, Elazabo. Fine. Right wing, Messi. Again. Or it has to be met. Oh, Hazard. Hazard is going to be a lot quicker as well. I mean, I'm not sure what we've got. We've got nothing there. Go in Barcelona. I think it has to be Messi, doesn't it? Messi already in that position there. Did we not pick a right wing? Did we forget to pick a right wing here? I think we did. Let's have a look see what sort of card we can get for a right wing. If we get Messi here, I'd be really annoyed. In fact, we don't pick anything really at all. So we just pick the best place. Ganabri, really? Uh, 95 pace, Lozano. Well, we can't use him, can we? So Messi's going to jump straight in there as well. The cards haven't been kind. I'm not going to lie. Ferran Torres. Uh, they haven't been kind at all, have they? Salah. Uh, we'll just stick him in there just because we can. We just need somebody in centre midfield. We want uh, Spanish in centre midfield. Right wing Chiesa. Wow. Uh, yes, please. If we were going with uh, Italy. Wow. Where do we go from here? There's a cam for Foden. We'll take Foden, I think, with... Uh, Quite easy. Can we stick him in there? That doesn't really do us any good. Uh, it doesn't help at all, does it? Okay, so that was a poor choice. But uh, I'm going to stick him instead of Johnny. Uh, let's pick another one. Left back, sure. Yes, please. Uh, he will do well with um, Rashford, actually, to be perfectly honest. He's quite pacey. I've not played with Shaw before. Yes, we'll have to go with Shaw. And who do we... I'm not sure who we take out, really. Left back. I don't know. We'll have a hunt round. So we've got two United players in. So that's not too bad. As a United fan, that's great there, James. Uh, this time we, we get a lot of... Um, do we get anybody? Yeah, we have got La Liga there. We want to cam, really, don't we? Or a centre mid. Um, Carrasco. Again, another fine choice. Ferran Torres on the right wing. We could potentially use him as well. But if I chose Carrasco instead, I think... Uh, yeah, we'll do that. I don't know where the, all these are going to fit in, though. Uh, we've got no centre mid at all. We are struggling for centre mids. None of these are actually going to help us at all. So let's just pick the better one. Pepe, he can come in as well. I'm not sure where these are going to fit in, to be perfectly honest. We could change it all together to right wing. Okay, Campos. Uh, wow. Um, yeah. Where do we go? Where do we go? Um, let's go Sanchez. I'm not... It's not great at all. Uh, the left back matches, matches, matches straight across it. It's just this bit here. It's um, I don't think we can get a decent side in here, can we? Oh, does that work? It's just this situation here that we haven't got. Uh, that goes up by eight. Kraska in there. So that does bring up a little bit, I guess. De Bruyne does miss out, though. Um, he's not going to be playing at all. Left back Rashford is a possibility. Mo Salah as well. Who do we bring in? Who do we bring in? Right back. That's one thing we've missed. And um, we've got left back in midfield, actually. In the centre back. Oh, there we go. We put Alba on the other side instead. Uh, yeah, we can we uh, switch things around a little bit? So we've got... It's a poor, poor draft altogether, isn't it? Uh, we've got left back here, actually. I, I thought we had centre backs. Can anybody uh, play here at all? Uh, nothing. Wow. It's... We have got centre back through Klosterman. It's not great. It's not brilliant at all. Gaia will have come in there. Uh, let's have a look at the manager then. It's a bad, bad choice of players, I think. Not great. I'm not happy about it. Um, right. No legal one. We have got two Spanish ones, though. Uh, De Gallo. Also, yeah, let's pick him. It don't really matter. It has brought it up a little bit, but that's the draft summary. It's not the best. I'm hoping we can do something out of this. Um, it's not the best. 186. That's terrible. That's horrible. Uh, hopefully, we'll uh, do something before we get into the team sheet. If we do, then I'll let you know. But obviously, we'll uh, just go straight into the footage. 
I'm not holding my breath. It's a very, very poor pickings. Right, after a lot of fiddling around, um, we've managed to get up to a 190. So I think that's probably one of my better ones. Alba was on the wrong side, and so was Navas. So I did switch them round. I did have the possibility of putting Rashford and Shaw in. It didn't quite get us to 100. I think it was 96 chemistry. But uh, we've switched it back again. Again, we're going La Liga almost. Uh, literally, it is La Liga team once again. Versus the Kittens. Thanks, Derek. I'm sure both coaches will want their players to, to take the lead. And a goal! They start as they mean to continue. They make the opening statement. And it's a quality pass. Can he make it count? Oh, a moment of pure class! Had to catch it perfectly, and didn't he just? Really a very poor ball. Oh, a nice-looking pass, and it might be. And he finds the net. He could hardly miss. Oh, a nice looking pass. Lionel Messi! Well, it's all going so swimmingly for them here. Another goal. And now it's a matter of avoiding any silly mistakes. Well, we see it again, Derek. There's all ways of scoring a goal. Laces outside of the foot. On this occasion, he uses his instep. It's a really, really good finish. Rashford. Rashford, fine pass. Chance here. What a lovely strike! Lethal piece of finishing! Drilled home with true conviction! Tremendous goal! Foden. A goal! We're really being spoiled! This is attacking football at its finest! Jesus Navas! What a lovely strike! Lethal piece of finishing! Drilled home with true conviction! Tremendous goal! Well, as we see again, that's how to score goals. Get the ball into the box from wide areas, and then just look at the finish. Reads the flight perfectly, and absolutely smashes it beyond the keeper. There's just no stopping that. Terriers might be able to cash in and slipped through beautifully. Oh, can you believe what we've just seen? I think we're going to be viewing that goal time and time again. Useful looking ball and danger still. Well, no let up, plenty of pressure. And the referee spotted the foul but has played advantage. Messi. Messi. Can he give them the advantage? In it goes! That will do nicely for starters. First goal of the game. Now can they make something happen? And making sure nothing untoward happened following the cross. Jesus Navas. It should be. Surely. It's gone in. And well, he might celebrate on the back of that. Well, it's good build-up, but there's one player standing in front of the goal, and it falls to him, and he's not going to miss from there. 
Oh, and there we have it. The whistle has just gone. My God, that was a hard-fought game. I'm not going to lie. It went into extra time. Oh, my word. That was just uh, that was just horrible. That was really horrible. We've got sweaty palms. I thought we were going to lose it. That was a really tough game. 2-1 in the end. And to be perfectly honest, we've, uh, we did pretty well. It's a fantastic uh, winner as well, and a strike from Planich as well. What, that is, uh, I mean, did that one go in? I don't think. Did it go in? No, it didn't go in. We win. We win. That's all that matters. It was a very, very hard fought game. 2 1, and uh, not as easy as the other games, that's for sure. But uh, what we did, we just held on to the wall a lot more, a bit more possession, 59% possession, as you can see there. We had a few, a lot more shots though. But as soon as we got into extra time, we um, we didn't decide to let them have the ball that much, uh, truth be told. But I found out in the earlier games that if you go at them and score within a couple of minutes, they seem to fold up away quite easily. But uh, that was a tough one to play, though. I have to say so let's have a look at some of the rewards that we're going to be getting then from this uh these winnings so uh four wins a two one in i mean as you can see it's, we concede our first goal and uh it's a very close compared to the other ones as well so let's, let's have a look uh jumbo premium gold pack and a jumbo a jumbo premium gold 26 pack doesn't sound exciting does it so let's have a look what we get in fact wow um not brilliant, are they? Let's go for the 24 first. And uh, drum roll, please. Boom, 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 boom. And what do we get? We get a rare card. It's not a walkout. It's not a board. Wow, that's disappointing. Wow, all that hard work. <laughs> uh, left. It's not a goalkeeper, though. Guzan's there. And whether or not we'll use him, I've got no idea. Are these untradables as well? Uh, no, they're not, actually. We can actually physically sell them. Uh, I'm not sure whether we can use any of that. I want to try and get a La Liga side going as well, actually, if I want, if I can. But uh, let's just have a look how much he goes for. Oh, fair bit as well, though, so we can get some uh, money. A goalkeeper. There had to be a goalkeeper somewhere, and uh, he brings in a, a little bit as well. So that's not to Charisma as well. Um, okay, not too bad. And we get a, um, a duplicate as well, which not going to bring in an awful lot. So let's move him down there. And uh, let's get red right into the next pack. Then the final pack. So just two packs today. It's not a very disappointing to go through all of that and just get two packs. So, but two big packs all the same. So it's a rare card. Again, it's not a walkout. It's not a board. That's really disappointing. I'm upset. I am upset. It's not going to improve our team. In fact, it's nowhere near improving our team at all. In fact, that's probably one of the worst packs we've ever had in this. I mean, what? I mean, we've got Fulham. Is that Fulham? No. Um, what what are these players here? Ukrainian, Saudi, Swiss. Oh, the Liga there. Turkey, Ukrainian, Italy. Italy. Well, I'm um, I'm dumbfounded to be perfectly honest. They are really really trash. I mean, how much does he go for? Not an awful lot. I don't know what we could use these guys for. Pedrino, a couple of thousand. If we can sell some of these for a couple of thousand, we will do. But yeah, not brilliant. Oh, we, can, we might get something for him possibly, and. Uh, OR, no, nothing at all. Right, okay, that's about it. I'm going to sort these transfers out. Uh, very disappointed, to say the least. In fact, what I might do, I might just shove them there. And uh, we have got some duplicates as well, which we can just offload. Um, not really interested. So another 600 coins there. We can sell the others. That is about it. Right, okay, very disappointing uh, pack openings for this draft. Um, we had a really hard-fought final, to say the least. In the end, it was a 190-rated team. It wasn't too bad, actually. Probably one of our better ones. La Liga seems to be the, the team to pick every single time, although we could have had a, a premiership team in the end. But uh, for the rewards, hard-fought, a good hour and a half playing time. Disappointing to get that. Uh, it was rubbish, to be perfectly honest. Uh, we'll see if we can offload some players in the transfer market and then we'll be back next week with another one. Until then, guys, thanks very much for watching. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. And until next week, thanks very much for watching. Thank you.